Laverty has been through a very significant amount of change over the last few years. It's a really exciting time to be in the university and there's a real buzz I think today by hosting such a conference as our TLE conference. This is the second conference that we've held, the last one was two years ago and there's a lot of really exciting practice being showcased, it's a great terrific uh, networking opportunity, it's an opportunity to learn from others and I think it's just a really good event to celebrate what's going on here at Abertay at such an exciting time. You can, actually come out, you can actually come closer to the audience, which can be a bit scary. But then more recently, uh, and we see some of the examples here today later on, I think, uh, the move towards active learning spaces. It's not enough just for academics to change the course, course teams to change the course. Institutions have to change. Institutions have to actually embrace this new landscape too. Aberty is it's putting the money in, it's putting the structures in, it's putting the staff in and it is really properly engaging with academic staff. I think today's TLE conference is, is a brilliant example of that. What's provided by the HERs and what's provided by our partners in healthcare settings. So to begin my research I invited students and graduates from across UAL to complete an online questionnaire and you realise you know, they've got this wealth of knowledge and skills beneath them but they just don't know how to identify their skills be it on a CV. In relation to our students coming from college then when we look at this population, our sports students over the last 15 years, then nearly half of them have come from further education. Up the top there's quite a lot of stuff about what is this open licensing and what does it mean for the way I do my job? For example, we wanted to encourage collaboration, we wanted to fund new work, we wanted student engagement, and we wanted evaluation to be built into the process. So I've been involved in both staff and student-led ATLEF projects, so it's an opportunity to apply for some funding to do some research, to create materials really related to teaching and learning that you might not usually do as part of your everyday teaching. Well, first of all, we were able to do something we were interested in and potentially help the university improve. You also get to work with qualitative and quantitative data, so that's something that you don't usually get to do. I think the new collaborative learning suite um, allows our students to get together in an environment where they can work together and share information that wouldn't have been possible in other learning environments. So being able to write on the wall, being able to um, bring their device and show it on screens and share amongst the groups and between different groups, sharing ideas and brainstorming. We shouldn't have to do fourth year computing. Um, seeing that there is opportunity to get funded for a project through that left for funding. The, the project was to develop um, a tool for student engagement, in particular student feedback, 